Hey there everybody and welcome back to Let's Play No More Heroes 2 Desperate Struggle. The fights have been coming thick and fast. We're ranked 7, we're almost at the end of the game, but about time we had yet another ranking battle. We were getting a nice cutscene as well, so enjoy that first. I must be having a nightmare. Or am I? Who's this little cutie? Is she real? Is she dangerous? How'd you do that? Read your thoughts? Well, you gave them to me. That doesn't make any sense. I was hoping you'd wander around some more. Explore. Me? Yes, you. You did not want to go back, so you reached out to my consciousness instead. Now we are one. Let's play. Away with you. I said be gone. The illusion's here for us. No way. We live together. I'll never leave. I'm going back. If you want to go to the other side, then I have no choice. I've got to kill you. Why don't you come with me? You'd like it there. I know you're trying to trick me. <laughs> I never did like anime. That's the reason why. I always thought it would come back to kill me in my dreams. It's not good. But yes, we get to fight as Sir Henry. Wow, Henry was the husband of Sylvia Christel. And uh, yeah, that's not great, is it? Because <laughs> uh, Travis Touchdown loves Sylvia Christel, uh, Christel, but Henry, he'd be trolling. He'll be taking that lady away. But hey, look, we get to play as Henry. Henry, and Henry is super cool. He's one of my favorite characters. And at the start of this battle, what I wanted to do was I wanted to show off the charge attack because I know I would have uh, some viewers probably talking about it. Uh, however, I couldn't get it done. I couldn't get it done because she kept using her laser attack. So apologies for that. Now, Henry. This is Mimi, by the way. Mimi is an anime character. I'm going to presume that she might be from uh, Bizarre Jelly 5. However, probably not because all the characters in Bizarre Jelly 5 have the, the word berry after their name. I don't know, I, I don't know too much about the Bizarre Jelly 5 anime, so feel free to correct me, but, you know, it would make sense, wouldn't it? She could just be some random character. But, oh god, I love Henry so much, where do I start? Henry is one of the quickest characters, and his B attack, instead of actually being a jump like Shinobu, or, or a kick or a punch like with uh, Travis, it's actually a dash. And this is great, because although you don't get the step in slash, like Travis Touchdown does, you can manufacture one by pressing B and then A. So you can uh, you can, you kind of have a, a pseudo uh, step in slash, and believe me, it helps. But with this battle, all you really need to do is do the same with all the other Travis Touchdown fights. Just look for the weak points, run around them until you find them, you know, open and then slash away. I get hit by this earthquake attack a lot. Just just roll away from the earthquake a quake attack and you'll be fine. Other attacks that she has, her big mecha has these hands and she can slap you around and that ain't good. Henry is too cool to be slapped around. She also fires rockets, she has this laser, she has a lot of things going on but to be honest, Henry's traits actually make this fight far too easy. He does twirl the saber around a bit too much. He's kind of like the uh, the Sabaki, um, uh, right, Ryu from the Ryu sword from the last game. It feels kind of like that because he twirls it around like a maniac, and it feels dead uncomfortable. However, with all the speed, you can get in so many quick slashes, and eventually you'll find that she's actually dead. Just make sure that when she floats up in the air, just try and use your dash. Try and get away. That way you will dodge her earthquake attacks, you will, you will dodge the uh, rocket attack as well. Those hands, she has two hand slapping moves. She will either do like a tornado slap in which you can actually block and you'll take very little damage. 
or you, or she'll just do a one-handed slab. That's her melee attack. Uh, again, you won't be getting too close to her very much. All you really be doing is running away from her, finding the weak spot, then running right back in. That was her one-hand slap there. It's not too bad, is it, guys? Believe me, it's not a tough fight whatsoever. I kind of want to use his charge of attack, though. Do you know the thing with the pink orbs? Because I think it's cool as hell. It's much better than Shinobu's. I, I, I prefer this than the, the Sonic Sword. A lot of people would disagree with me, I'm sure. But she's almost dead, and I need to use it. I feel the need to use it. I'm dashing away, because I don't want to get hit by the laser, because I'm doing so well. I've not lost much health. I forgot about this fight, and I'm doing so well in it. I really don't want to lose any more health. But she's losing so much health now, so I try it, and I hit her. No, I don't. It misses. So I need to do it again. I need to do it again, guys. I need to hit her at least once with one of these orbs. Bang! There we go. It, it wasn't very effective, but if you charge it up properly, if you get, I think there's three orbs that comes out. I'm not too sure, but if you charge it up fully, it will do a lot of damage. But as she gets to her last square, she's almost dead. A couple more dashes, a couple more slashes, and hopefully we can get to slice this this uh, character open. Can we awake from our coma? Find out now. <laughs> <laughs> I love how it says disintegrated here. It's like dead is just too bad for uh, Henry. He has to have a fancy word, doesn't he? <laughs> Cutscene. No way. Oh, chill out. What the bloody hell? About time you woke up. Yeah. Are you the one who rescued me? I had a fight to win. You were just collateral damage. So get out when you can manage it. Until then, I've got some good shit on video. We'll see about that. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Oh Travis. You should put that monkey away. There's someone sleeping in your bed. It's not good to do with that. <laughs> But yeah, Mimi's dead and Henry's awake. Huzzah, we've been reunited and uh, Travis just loves Henry, doesn't he? <laughs> yeah, right. Even more cutscenes. Travis, forgive your big brother who's too much of a shite bag to thank you face to face. You're the big brother? <laughs> You're How do you know I didn't pop out which first? Which one of us popped out first? And the point is... There's no honor in getting rescued by my younger, big brother. So I took it upon myself to proper kill Scott Gardner, Greg Cantrell, and Massimo Bellini. You've got to so be kidding me. Would you fifth. fucking people and stop no stealing my me. kills? This makes us even, as far as the rescue goes. You and I still have a score to box off, but that's another subject entirely. So don't get yourself killed till we have the chance to finish our fight. Damn it, Irish ass. He could at least have told me more about those assassins. And in case you were wondering, well, I took pictures of the three Skangers as souvenirs. How long is this You'll message? Just have to drool over them, because there's no way you can play through these fights. The game's stuffed full as it is. Pics came out nice, though. They probably make good wallpaper for your cell. Well, I'm out of things to say, so I'll hang up now. Hmm. Long message, isn't it? Hello? Travis, it's me. I have arranged the next fight. Come to my office. Gotcha. The inclusion, the inclusion of Henry in this game was absolutely necessary. He is a cool guy and the fans loved him. However, that's it. That's the end of Henry. You will never see him again. So, we're back to minigame madness next time on Let's Play. No More Heroes 2. Desperate Struggle. See you later, guys.